we've put guidelines in place for the arenas and the pools that we're opening up this weekend. Um, but as with everybody else, we've never done this before. Um, so we've done the, the best effort that we can and working with our groups and trying to figure out what, what we can do. Um, but we've really left it open for them to communicate back to us because this is, a be as you said, this is the best effort, is, is we really don't know what's going to happen once the people hit the facility. So, so we're leaving it wide open that we'll make changes, we'll pivot as necessary uh, and do, do what we can do to make the experience better for our public and for the groups that are coming in. We, so we're really looking for that feedback as people come through um, because unfortunately, the reality of the situation is when people come in, what they're finding, we're not, not going to be able to be as flexible as we normally are. In a situation, we're usually very responsive and try to get people out to things. This time, we're following guidelines. And if we don't follow those guidelines, um, you know, the authorities that be can shut our facilities down. So we're going to be very, very uh, sticklerish with the, with the rules and having to follow, not because we want to make things uncomfortable for, for the patrons, but because we want to keep our facilities open and, and keep moving into the future.